hi guys and welcome back to my channel in this video i'm going to be showing you how to make black rice dip conditioner for massive hair growth okay so if you want to see how i make this keep watching so these are the things i'm going to be using i'm going to be using uh black rice avocado aloe vera and also mayonnaise but you can use whatever you have at home with black rice so I'm using a very good quality of uh, black rice, so I'm not going to be rinsing them out. But if you don't trust your your white uh, black rice, you can always rinse them before cooking, okay? So I added water and I'm going to allow the rice to cook. And while the rice is cooking, here is me uh, shampooing my hair with my DIY black soap um, shampoo that I make. I also have this channel here on my, I mean the video here on my channel, you might want to check it out as well so here is me after shampooing my hair guys i don't know how my hair shrinks back so much like so much i don't know why my hair you know you will see how long my hair is when i said when i'm on deep conditioning okay so here we are uh, rice is cooked and i'm going to be adding the rice into my blender after the rice i'm going to be adding uh avocado aloe vera uh hair growth tea yeah that is what i added i also have it on my channel after that i'm going to be adding my mayonnaise and aloe vera as well you can also add oil if you want okay so after adding all the ingredients i'm going to blend them to get that to cream okay guys it's time to blend i don't know why i keep making this mistake with this sieve here i don't, don't even know why i got it anyway it's very good with oil it helps me filter the oil out uh without water go, uh, going into the oil whenever i infuse oil so i'm going to remove that uh deep conditioner from that sieve and add it to the one that can get the job done for me so after that i'm going to sieve this this deep conditioner i'm going to uh, sieve them twice because i don't want any build up of whatsoever on my hair i don't want anything to trap on my hair i want just the creamy texture so after uh going in with the sieve i'm going to go ahead to sieve them again with my scarf which you're going to be seeing in another clip okay guys here we are i just love how this scarf is getting the cream out of this like <laughs> it's so relaxing as i'm editing this video watching this particular clip i'm just like feeling re relaxed seeing how the cream uh, is coming out of that scarf you know but if you don't want to go through the process of saving this twice you can actually go once you know with scarf don't use the other thing just use this scarf to save it okay don't go through the other process this is more easy just use your scarf okay so i'm going to go ahead to do everything and this is what i didn't want to get you know have trapped on my hair so i'm going to get rid of that and um, at this point you can add any oil of your choice but i'm not going to be using oil in this uh, conditioner okay so time to start applying them you see my hair do you just take a look at how my hair looks right now i think it looks very short to you guys like this hair looks short right just keep washing this hair as i deep condition my hair keep washing and see how much long my hair is i don't know if there is anything i can do to this shrinkage to stop guys i don't know if there is anything i can do if you have a solution but i don't want to texturize my hair like relax my hair i don't want to do that okay but how can i have hair that is a bit longer i i know it's not uh like waist length 
but my hair is long take a look at my hair guys just take a look at the hair just take a look at how long is my hair but when the hair is dry a bit it just shrink back like i have short hair i don't know what is wrong with my hair this is why i actually don't follow every tip that is uploaded on youtube because i know what works for my hair and i go for what works for my hair and i will advise you guys to do so any ingredient or any recipe that works for you i will advise you to stick to that and not you know don't use this don't use that this use this the other one use that one don't use oil use oil do what works for you when it comes to natural hair because everybody has different hair type just like me now i started this with a very short hair but the moment i started applying the deep conditioner the real length of my hair started coming out so do what work for your hair this is the advice i'm going to give you guys okay here is my husband yeah he's all over this video today <laughs> okay so <laughs> he's saying nice to meet you guys hi <laughs> okay so back to what i was saying i said do what work for your hair look at how long my hair is guys look at how long my hair is like i have noticed that I, my hair loves a rice uh conditioner avocado conditioner and banana as well my hair loves this conditioner so these are my one of my go-to deep conditioner anytime i want to do diy deep conditioner so i don't i don't even want to listen to anybody telling me otherwise to use or not to use because i have tried the bottle deep conditioner here in italy and none of them was working for me only diy okay of course i haven't tried the american one because the shipping is ridiculous amount so the diy is what work for me and i want to stick to it and uh, like please just stick to what works for your hair and uh, don't listen to otherwise because the person that advice that is advising you might have a different hair textures and the, uh, when you quit the one that is working for your hair you go for the one that is working for your hair you will see that you regret it so please this natural hair community there is a lot of t-shirts in on this natural hair community just my advice is do what work for you see my hair that looks short my hair is freaking long like my hair is long i cut this hair before braiding my hair and my hair is growing back a lot so yeah now i'm done applying and detangling my hair i'm going to go ahead now to put up the you know uh clean feel for my hair because i want to trap every bit of heat on this hair so after wrapping them up with uh, that clean feel i'm going to go ahead with a plastic bag and also shower cap and allow them to sit for one hour you can allow them to sit for 30 minutes before washing them off okay but i allow mine to sit for one hour before uh, washing them off with my conditioner Okay guys this is after one hour time to wash them out and this is the only condition that is still working for me here in italy sun sleek uh coily uh hair up brand is still working for me i'm using their shampoo and their um, uh, the conditioner for now until i find another one that will work for my hair but i've been using this for over two years or thereabouts so i'm done washing my hair and this is what my hair looks like uh, yes i added the leave-in conditioner of the same sun slick as well and that is not built up that is just the leave-in conditioner hanging on my hair like that i don't know why i haven't find a cream that i think i need to make my own hair cream yes so this is the back of my hair guys look at how full it is i love it i think the reason why my front hair looks short is because because my hand i always cut my hair that is because i just don't like split ends so i get rid of split end a lot on my hair i think this is why my front hair is shorter than my uh, the back of my hair which i don't mind at all because what i'm going for is healthy hair you know healthy hair is what i care about more than length of course if the hair grow to my waist length tomorrow i will love it but as i'm going to that um you know waist length stuff i still want my hair to be healthy so i do cut my hair a lot but i'm not advising you to do the same if it won't work for you but i love the length i'm having right now and i love how healthy my hair is so i'm just trying to style them because i kind of wanted to make uh, you know carry them like wash and go but we'll see how that ends so that is the end of this video guys please give it a try if you think you like it thank you for watching share and subscribe and i will see you in my next one god bless you all bye